Hello all, welcome to Instagram Holdings, your worldwide instrument partner. Today I am going to walk you through the product Testo 175T3 Temperature Data Logger. The, this data logger typically measures the uh, temperature values in the range from minus 50 to 1000 degree centigrade. Okay, so uh, this basically data logger is having two special features like it is having uh, two channel for temperature measurement as you can see channel 1 and channel 2 as mentioned here and it, this data logger is having the measuring records of 1 million capacity actually that is 10 lakhs 10 lakhs measurement it can uh, take and it can record in this particular data logger so this data logger comes with two external thermocouple probes as you can see here which is best suited when recording temperatures at two different locations in parallel some of the technical data of this particular instrument are as follows the measuring range for this uh, K-type thermocouple varies from minus 50 to 1000 degrees centigrade and the resolution for the same is 0 0.1 degrees centigrade. Uh, it also supports uh, T-type thermocouple whose range is from minus 50 to 400 degrees centigrade and the resolution for the same is 0 0.1 degrees centigrade. The weight of this uh, instrument is around 440 grams and it does have the operating temperature which varies from minus 20 to plus 55 degrees centigrade. It has a protection class of uh, IP65 and uh, uh, and uh, uh, of 10, from 10 seconds to 24 hours and it does have a warranty of 3 years. Okay. So let me tell you uh, how to configure this instrument with the help of software actually. As you can see, this is a mini USB cable, which which is an optional accessory, which does not come along with this product. If you want to procure this cable, you need to have at an extra cost, actually. So, since I am having this USB cable with me, I will try to connect with the this instrument to the PC, which which I am having. So, this uh, as you can see, this uh, is a uh, instrument. This instrument is having provision for mini USB cable. Uh, on the right hand side of this instrument I can I will open this and show you as you can see there there is a provision mini USB cable provision here and a reset option in the middle and a as storage capacity SD card provision which is pre present at the right uh, right hand side of this instrument it uh, does also have battery compartment it supports three AAA batteries at the back side of this instrument you need to open the uh, this panel with the help of a screw and keep the batteries since i have kept already the batteries and, and i will connect the instrument to the pc so i will connect will just plug in this mini usb cable as you can see i have plugged in this mini usb cable into this instrument and now i will show you the software so this is a dashboard this is a dashboard of software which whose name is Testo Comfort Software Basic 5.0. As you can see, it is mentioned here, Testo Comsoft Basic Software. So, this is the dashboard of this instrument, and many options are coming here. Testo 175, 176, 174, 175, 77. So since my instrument is test to 175 T3, I will try to connect it. I will go, this is the home page of this instrument, start page or home page you can say. There are various options present at this home screen. First one is connect instrument, next is import measurement data and next is show instrument status and the last one is configure operating operating settings so i have since this is a test 175 t3 data logger i have connected this instrument by clicking on the connect option and you can see it is connected battery status is showing as 100% and the instrument name is mentioned here i have a, you can edit this um, with the help of option present in settings page the last readout is today's date where that is 16th november 2019 and the time is 4 pm
this is the serial number of this instrument this is the firmware version and the operating mode so without wasting any time i will go to the operating configuration page as you can see there are various options present in this page so that you can configure according to your usage so let me show you the the recording the recording can be done in three time three ways first one is start time second is with the help of date and time present here and second is with the help of data logger the start button data logger present on the top of this instrument you can see the go if you will press the this key for uh, max of 3 seconds then it will automatically start the reading and the third one the last is software start option by this you can start and stop the recording with the help of software next is the storage cycle depending upon the your requirement you can set it for hour minutes and seconds duration as you can see here in the screen this is the measuring interval this also can be set by the user and the stop criteria is also of three types first one is memory full second is circular buffer memory and the third one is number of measurement values suppose i have to take only five measurement values i can set with the help of this option and i can change as per my requirement okay and the next is unit selection unit selection you can do from your end as per your requirement next is challenge settings this is the main setting which i want to in, uh, let you know um, which i want to inform you about this actually we are having um, only one sensor available with this instrument which is k type thermocouple so you need to configure this to your software actually so as you can see number one and number two channel settings are mentioned here so depending upon your uh, depending upon your choice you can just plug in the k type thermocouple uh, available with your instrument and and configure as per your requirement so i will show you how, how to do that this is a typical k type thermocouple as you can see k type thermocouple and i will configure this to channel 1 so just you need to plug in this k type thermocouple now the sensor is attached to the instrument this is the k type thermocouple and now i will change the sensor type from switched off to k nickel chromium thermocouple the range is mentioned here as i already told you minus 50 to 1000 degrees centigrade this is correct so no need to change this and if you want to change also you can change it as per your application if you want to keep it till 500 degrees centigrade only you can do the same and this i will keep it as it is because no such uh, another probe i am having so as of now i am keeping this as it is next what you have to do is after doing all the changes just switch the tab here and see whether everything is fine or not yeah it's everything is fine i have already mentioned the instrument name here and the display setting you can change according to your usage it's on you can on it for five seconds or you can keep it as off so as i want to switch the display on i have kept it as on so after doing all these things you just need to save this to the instrument so what i will do is i will click on transfer to instrument which will load the settings to instrument and the display which error is coming it will change to normal reading which is been taken by the sensor part so currently it is showing as 30.1 degrees centigrade as measured by this k type thermocouple currently this is in wait stage as no recording is being done by this instrument it is only measuring it is not recording the data so if i want to record the data i just need to press this button which is go by for three seconds as the start criteria i have mentioned as start button on instrument so i will press this in key and as you can see the backlit is on and the record recording has been started which is displayed by the rec symbol here so this way you can configure this data logger and start the readings
you can also evaluate and see the data measured by this instrument for your reference i have evaluated the data before which i have recorded with the help of this instrument i will show you just you can have a check this is the data which is it has measured for the last period of time from last half an hour it's 1534 from 1534 to 1538 it, duration is of 4 minutes various data i have captured and i have kept it here as you can see this data has been taken at 1453 start time and 1459 the stop time this is the second data and this is the third data you can import various data recorded by this instrument suppose as you can see the recording has been started by the instrument and uh, the data has been recording as you can see the recording symbol is there to stop the measurement i just need to press on this option that is stop measurement and after that i can import the data wherever i can i want to so i will go under the evaluating section under that import measurement data and i will click on this option this is the import measurement data and the import history import history you can see the previous data which i have saved and here the live data which is being measured by the instrument number of units inputs has been measured four so four number of data will be there in this so i will be saving on my desktop and as you can see importing data and it's almost completed so four data has been recorded as i already told four data as recorded by the ins instrument over the period of this time by taking video you can also send this data over email as an option and alarms also can be set so that's what that's all i want to say about this instrument to more about more to know more about this particular data logger and other sort of data loggers like temperature and humidity you can always visit our website that is www.instucar.com and do the purchase for from the same thank you